Hi, I'm Mark Tucker of Yara UK Limited, heading up the marketing and, agro and agronomy department. Um, just chaired the crop nutrition session and we've had a real discussion around nitrogen management particularly, which is probably one of the most or the biggest investment that the farmer is going to make over the coming months whether it's the arable farmer or the livestock farmer. So the real focus is around how we maximise the return on the investment he makes from that input. So the discussion has featured about the, the rates that we use. There's all too often a blanket application towards fertiliser around using one particular rate. What we've tried to and learnt from the session there is that around the optimum there's quite a big spread. So we want farmers to really think about the application rate on a field by field and even within field scenario. Moving on from that then we discussed and took home messages from Philippe so some very unique work done in France on long-term experiments around the use of different forms of nitrogen, something that's never been done in the UK so it's nice to learn from that experimentation. It's a 12-year study and again has emphasised the longer-term effects that the farmer makes when he makes specific choices around nitrogen. So the experimentation was all around urea and ammonium nitrate and what the very clear signal was, was this 4 to 5% yield difference that you build into your system through long term use of urea. So that's a yield detriment by using long term urea um, applications. So really the take home message for the farmer is again is to weigh up that decision and the choice he makes around nitrogen source, whether he chooses urea, whether he chooses ammonium nitrate, because that will have a long-term impact on his yield aspiration. So finally then, Pete Barry went on to talk about really the, how farmer, the farmer can maximise the profitability out of his oilseed crop, highlighting a three-year study and research which has looked at foliar nitrogen as we get to the end of the season. And in again there, uh, Peter was showing this 0.2 to 0.3 tonne a hectare yield to be gained from a small investment in, a, in extra fertiliser of around 40 to 50 kilograms. So some really important take home messages around the application rate we choose, the type of fertiliser we use in the form of nitrogen and then how we can optimise further with all seed. I think the other highlight is again that's nitrogen but you'll only achieve that return if we consider everything else within the farming system that isn't going to limit yield.